hello everyone welcome back to our youtube channel boomi world hope everyone is doing great if you want to learn dal boomi from scratch please follow our youtube channel if you haven't watched my previous videos please go and check it out now so in this video i'm going to discuss about what is clen shape and how to configure clen shape on boomi so first we look what is clen shape so clen shape is used to validate document field values and either repair or reject the document before further processing so how to validate document field values i'll tell you one real time sample scenario uh, suppose you are getting some employee details from source system and your target system ask you to do some restrictions while processing all records those restrictions like id is mandatory field so if there is no id from source system just don't process that particular record and the phone length should be 10 to 15 characters if phone length more than the 15 characters then trim the left character trim if phone number length is less than 10 characters then append zeros to the phone number up to 10 characters so these are the restrictions which target system ask you to perform so we can see how to configure clen shape with these restrictions on boomi okay so this is our raw boomi platform right so for time being i am just removing this process route shape and this top shapes as well okay so clen shape is one of the logical shapes so you can find clen shape under logical shape so i am just dragging and dropping the clen shape So here you can find definition of the clen shape. The clen shape enables you to validate document field values and either repair or reject the document before further processing. It is often helpful to use clen shape before a map shape so that invalid values can be corrected before potentially causing errors while mapping. So this is the definition of the clen shape. So after that we have display name. So this is not a mandatory option. If you want to give any name, you can give. Otherwise, you can leave as it is. Okay. So after that we have profile type. So here we need to choose for which profile you have restrictions. Suppose you are getting some flat file, and the target system ask you to perform some restrictions. So in that case, you need to choose profile type as flat file. After that, you need to choose. profile which profile it is okay so this is the profile okay here you can see detailed fields of the flat file so here clen shape uses a profile to determine which restrictions to validate so the restrictions are defined in the profile at the field level so for each field we can set restrictions as of now we have restrictions for id and then phone number right so i am just clicking on id for id we need to check whether it is a mandatory field or not right so i am just clicking on mandatory option here so that if there is no id value from source system those records will terminate okay so after that we have another field phone number so for phone number we have uh, length validations right so if you see here we have field size options and we have option called field length validation so here we need to check this field length validation box after that we have minimum length and maximum length restrictions right so minimum length should be 10 and then maximum length should be 15 so as per our requirement we need to uh, enter minimum length and then maximum length okay so this is how we need to set restrictions in the profile so now i'm just closing and saving the profile so here you can see restrictions profile id and then phone number in red color so earlier you saw only arrow buttons like other fields so after setting the restrictions on profile level uh, you can see red color here okay so i'm just clicking on the id part so here you can see this element is mandatory because we set id as a mandatory element okay so what is our requirement if the document contains id In that time only we need to process that record otherwise we need to reject the record right so if you see here if empty no repair reject the document or set a default value suppose your client ask you to set any default value uh, if id is null from source system at that time you can choose set default value and then you need to declare the default value here so as per our requirement we don't want to repair any document we just need to reject the document so i just selected this option 
so after that we have phone number okay so here we have two restrictions minimum length restrictions and then maximum length restrictions so first we'll see minimum length restrictions if two shots if the phone number is less than the 10 characters there are multiple options the no repair just reject the document and prepend character to pad length and append characters to pad length so as per our requirement we have to append zeros to the phone number right so that's why i'm selecting append and which character we need to append zero right so i'm just giving on zero okay so if the element has a maximum length restrictions if the phone number is too long more than the 15 characters if the phone number is too long what we have to do no repair just reject the document trim leading characters and trim trailing characters okay so as per our requirement we have to trim the characters right leading characters okay so i'm just selecting the trim leading characters so if the phone number is more than the 15 characters it will trim the leading characters up to 15 okay so this is how we need to configure clen shape on boomi so now we'll run the process to see the result so i'm just connecting message shape to clen shape so here you can see two paths clean path and rejected path so if there is any repairs on clen shape those repair documents will go to the clean path rejected documents will go to the rejected path now i'm placing just top shape here and for rejected path also stop shape so we have id and then phone number as well so the phone number uh, length is less than the 10 characters so we'll see whether it will append zeros to the phone number or not i'm just running the process with the atom and clicking on ok see the process execution got started ok see the process execution got completed so we'll see final result of the process see zeros are appended up to 10 characters so this is how we need to configure clean shape on boomi hope you understand the video yeah that's it about today's video if you like my video please like share and subscribe to our youtube channel and please don't forget to click the bell icon so that you will get all notifications whenever i post the video thank you all see you in my next video until then bye bye